Right then, it's time to get this pool up and running and ready for summer. Looking pretty again. What I'm gonna have to do, cover's pretty dirty, it's been on all winter. Is that a jet wash? Clean it all off, roll it off, see what the water's like. I don't think it's bad because the pump's been running. So, uh, jet wash the cover, clean the pool, and then I'm gonna make it look even better, especially at night with these new lights that I'm gonna be installing. So I've got two different types of lights. These two here, they've got a cord so you can plug them in and they stay bright as they need to the whole time. And then you've got these two packs here, they're rechargeable and there's two in each one. So two in there, two in there, two in there. Six lights all together that I'm gonna be putting in this pool. These generally are good for above ground pools. They're magnetic, so they've got a plate that you have on the outside and then you put the light on the wall on the inside and it sticks and holds in place. But you can use these on any type of pools concrete pools, liner pools, anything. They, they come, there's some glue in there that you just glue to the plate, stick it to the wall, and then stick the light to the plate, and then it holds in place. But anyway, let's get this cleaned up, the pool already, and then we'll be checking these lights out and seeing how well they do at night, of course. <laughs> So that's the cover cleaned up. It's time to get the pool chemicalized. I need sanitizing, a day or so of filtration, and then I'll come back, hoover it all out. It's good because I need to get, I need to get these lights charged up so that they're ready to go. Looking forward to seeing what these look like. Before getting them charged up, unbox them with you guys and see what we've got inside. Obviously the bulbs. 16 colors dimming, remote control, rechargeable battery. So you can set it on a timer so it can do two two hours, four hours or six hours. Obviously waterproof, RGB, W, red, green, blue, white. So these two need charging up. That one is just plugging. Just open this one first. Instructions. These are little magnetic plates. So you can put this on the outside of your above ground pool. And here are the lights. So this will go inside, pull that off. This will go inside, obviously. And then it will hold onto the wall of your, of your pool. It's quite long cables on them, obviously, so you can be quite far away from the pool. Um, it's definitely needed. Glue. So if you need to stick the magnetic plate onto the wall, just glue that area there, put it on, leave it for a bit, I suppose, to, to dry, and then stick on the, the light. Remote control. Missed out on here, obviously. An app, so you can change all the colors, a million different colors on your phone and apparently uh, goes to the beat of music as well. So that'd be pretty cool to see. And then the little light itself, it's quite small, but obviously above ground pools aren't that big. Plug it in there, turn it on here. All right, I'm back. Pool's looking really good. It's been filtering overnight. Nice and clear. Just gonna give it a hoover. Get all the leaves out and stuff. And then I'm gonna get these in. The uh, rechargeable ones all charged up. And the plug-in ones are ready to go. There's an app I've downloaded. It was so easy. Like the easiest app I've downloaded. And it like just connected itself basically on its own. Anyway get this cleaned up get the lights in it's almost night time it's not going to be long until it starts getting dark and then we'll be able to see how well these lights work That's the 
pool all cleaned up. So, it's looking great. What I'm gonna do first is try out the re these rechargeable um, LED lights first. And what I'm gonna do, because they're not gonna stay here, the pool's already got all light here and it's not my pool, so I'm gonna stick them. I took off the inlets and I've put them to that, stuck them to that, like that. So I'll screw them back in the wall and stick two there. Um, there's an outlet over there and then the steps are gonna be going in here and then one gonna be stuck to the steps. I just wanna point out that these ones are quite small for, well, maybe this pool's a bit too big. They're definitely gonna be more suited for the above ground pools, but I just don't have one at the minute. <laughs> this is the only pool I can work on, so just bear that in mind. I don't know how well they're gonna they're gonna do once it's really dark. So but while it is still a little bit light, this is the remote for one of the set of um, lights. You're gonna be able to turn it on and off when it's in the water, obviously, change the colours. Um, you've obviously got the flash modes, fade, smooth. Um, you can make them brighter or you can dim them down. And then you can also set the timers. So once it is dark, I'll be giving them a go. Two of those. I'm gonna clip these in before it gets really dark. Make sure these are shut so no water gets inside. All right, then we have light, and I've got to say, I undersold them earlier when I was talking about you know they're a bit small, probably a bit small for this pool, but for four little lights. This pool is shining. Red. It's quite dark. And orange. Orange down here. Yes. I'm loving these lights, honestly. But I'm gonna get him doing some Get some flash going. This is the four little lights on their own, all in with the color white. Look at that, it's lovely. finish off with these lights then on a pretty light green it's in the green column anyway but looks great they've done a lot better than what I thought they were going to do especially for the size of the pool and the size of the lights themselves they're pretty small and to be honest they're quite affordable as well the pool does have a light you could probably buy 10 of these Imagine having 10 of them in the pool for the price of what it would cost for one of those lights. Anyway, time to check out the plug-in lights with the app, see what they're like. All right, so these are the plug-in LEDs and they've got just enough cable for me to put, because they're both on one plug and they split and then they've got, um, um, a transformer in the middle so there's just enough cable for me to put them put one this end and one that end of the pool very bright i'm gonna change up some colors get the flash going but yeah pretty impressed with these ones
those are the Layla Muley lights and I was quite surprised these worked really well especially these ones that you plug in so simple to use download the app they connect straight away and they're really bright and then the rechargeable ones as well I was quite surprised with these especially given the size of them and the pool that I used them on they worked really well and they was quite bright too so highly recommended from me make sure to check out the description for the link to these lights and any discount codes as well follow your boy for the pool work